uh, hello everybody, uh, timing solution digest number 15, uh, this digest about special uh, Venus synodic uh, cycle, uh, actually this is not simple cycle, this is filtered cycles uh, for euro, euro is there. You see, uh, let's, I will calculate Venus synodic cycle standard way with timing solution. Uh, this is, I have downloaded uh, euro since time, time solution data fit and let's do uh, do this. I will calculate this cycle standard way astronomy button and here uh, choose uh, standard cycle click in this button choose uh, uh, second item the uh, most uh, important cycles firstly this is annual of course the second this is uh, Venus synodic cycle. Uh, this is how this cycle works. Uh, when you analyze any cycle, firstly you need to remember about the period of analyzed cycles. You see the period of this cycle is uh, 584 days, approximately 984 days. Uh, here it is. You see it uh, shows period here. So uh, remember this period. Uh, next look at this projection line and you see the problem is, uh, let's I will set LBC somewhere here. here. And the problem is, last uh, more than a year, a year, almost two years, you see, so for some reason, uh, Venus synodic cycle for uh, Forex does not work. A user reported me about that many times, I know about this fact, so we have, um, somehow it does not work. Uh, actually, somehow it works. Uh, still, uh, it works, uh, still work here, but uh, here it was, uh, I don't know. So, uh, we have actually another uh, approach, uh, how to calculate this cycle uh, based on uh, similarities. Similarities. Uh, let's do this. I will um, hide, I will uh, put it here. I will set LBC to last price bar, click in this button and look at this. Now I run intermarket model. And now I want to like the I would like to find the most similar period in the past based on Venus synodic cycle. Venus synodic cycle. So uh, firstly, uh, let's uh, set this parameter last bar. Uh, last bar it uh, covers period. Um, uh, last bar is 250 days and uh, it covers period uh, 300. Um, uh, 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 352 days. Uh, let's increase this, this parameter. We want to get the period of uh, Venus cycle. We need to get here uh, 584 uh, days. So I will increase this value till um, uh, I, I will get 584 days. Uh, let's will do that. Almost done. Uh -uh. Okay, you see, uh, if we analyze last uh, 416 days, the covered period will be exactly Venus synodic cycle. 584 days. Uh, you see, uh, look at this. We can actually we can use this button. You see, and it will display uh, to cover this interval. Okay, you see from LBC, from last bar to this vertical line, uh, this is period, uh, this is interval covers 460 bars, bars, uh, um, and uh, this period covers period 484 days. This is uh, Venus synodic cycle. Another, another, another words, this period covers one Venus synodic cycle. Next step we will find similarities. Uh, so, now uh, do, uh, do this. Now uh, click this button here. Oh, not yet. Uh, you need to um, click this button to make a um, copy. So, we will analyze uh, Euro uh, again, uh, against uh, Euro. And now, here, click this button. Custom cycle period. Custom period. Here it is. And here you, you type uh, the... Um, uh, period of analyzed cycle. Let's uh, type it more precisely. Uh, 584 point, uh, point 92 days. So this is period of Venus synodic cycle. Okay. And what program does? The program has found the most similar period in the past uh, 
uh, based on Venus synodic cycle. In other words, for these moments, Venus synodic cycle has exactly the same phase as, it, as uh, we have now. So, the most similar period in the past, this is um, uh, this, uh, uh, this um, uh, September 9, uh, 1983. This is how the cycle worked in the past. So, we need to shift uh, on this amount of days and we'll get the most similar uh, period in the past. Okay, we keep this uh, period in, the, in mind. And next, we have 1994. 1994. This is how this period looks. And let's uh, make a copy of this similarity. Click this button. This button, you see, create uh, duplicate. Okay, you see, we have exactly the same similarity. Just make a copy. Next step. Uh, we have similarity, we have exactly the same phase uh, for Venus Synodic Cycle in, um, in uh, uh, April 21, 2001. How the similarity looks? Okay, you see how it looks. This is a red line, this is uh, 2001, and this is black, this is current chart. Uh, so we will use this similarity for our uh, forecast as well. Uh, next, uh, 2007, uh, let's look at this similarity. Uh, maybe it's not so good because you see it's, uh, there is a discrepancy here between black and red. Okay, I will not use this similarity. Uh, 2002, mm, I don't know, 1980, uh, 1983, no, 1988, no. So, in other words, I have found uh, only three, the most similar period in the past. This is 1983 and other periods here, there. So, we have three similar periods in the past. And next step I would like to recommend to you, this is um, calculate the um, superposition. This is a composite based on these uh, three, uh, three um, uh, similarities. Click, this, uh, highlight this item and click composite. Now this is for a cast based on uh, uh, filtered sim similarities. Uh, so, it seems to me that this is a very interesting approach uh, because you see, you, you, you choose the most similar periods in the past uh, um, based on your experience. You, you're trying to find some historical analogy. Uh, so, it seems to me this is a very interesting approach and the same way, way you can analyze any cycle, like, uh, like an annual cycle or any other cycle. So, thank you.